What's up, it's your boy Brian Ash, a.k.a. The Handsome Fist, and welcome back to another 300 seconds. Now, it's Tuesday, and a lot of times, like, people talk like, oh, my God, Mondays are so bad, Mondays are so bad, 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 bad. No, no, no. Tuesdays are the worst days. Now, let me tell you how this starts out. First off, there was a gang of traffic today. That sucks. They created some construction today. That sucked. So, it took me longer to get there and way longer to get home. Sucks. Very sucks. So, I get to work today. My time. I get to work. And, you know, like, partway through my morning, I'm like, time for that morning constitution, boys. So I go, and every single stall is empty. So I go to the last one, man rules, last one, sit down, mind my business. In walks this dude who comes in and unleashes a grunting seven-layer burrito next to me that was... Making it made more noise than the Austin Powers rumble. Like, we have man rules in the bathroom, too, man. I know you ladies got rules in the bathroom when you guys go together, you guys do this, you guys talk your game, you guys, you know, game plan. In the bathroom for men, you skip every other urinal unless there's not a, another urinal, you don't skip, then then you know, you, you know, whatever. You don't talk, you don't talk in the shitter. Unless there's a conversation that started when you walked in, but you keep that conversation with that man, that man only until it's over. And as soon as you step in front of the urinal or go into the stall, conversation stops, bro. It's fucking phone. It's fucking news. It's Facebook. It's the game that you play, whatever. Whatever gets you through your business is how you roll, man. And this dude breaking every man code known to man, empty bathroom, comes in, stall next to me, and grunts out a seven-layer burrito. Like, bro, come on, come on, man. Like, the, there's rules and code of conduct in the bathroom for men, man. And you just broke all of them. You broke them. You broke the goddamn rules, man. So, yeah, I had to pour a drink today, man. It's frustrating. Stuck in traffic for fucking 45 minutes longer than I needed to be. Stuck in traffic for 15 minutes longer this morning than I need to be. And, like, I'm just, like, I just don't know. Like, it's, Tuesdays are my days to suck. But, you know, I, I, I'm loading up the stream. I'm going to calm down. I'm going to smoke a couple cigarettes. I'm going to have me a cocktail. I'm just going to breathe and relax, you know, and just let the day go. Let the day go. So, anyway, man, what is your guys' worst day of the week? What's your worst day of the week? Oh, shit, snap, crack, pop. And then, like, the customer takes a bunch of my stuff that is supposed to be for my um, line, and they move it to another line, which is it's fine. They own it. They own it. But now i got to bring more over to me. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm in a different building right now, so now i gotta, I had to call headquarters and say, hey, look, I need six, eight more of these things. Can you build them and send them over? Like, not a big deal. Not, not a huge deal. But nobody confronted me and asked me first. They just did it. It's like, man, look, man, like, if my stuff was set up and set out like it, like, like they said, it should have been a no-brainer. Should have been done, Gonzo. But no, these guys got to do their thing and get in my way. And it just, I just, it was just that day. You know what I'm saying? Just that day. And it's Tuesday, but you know, like everyone bitches about Mondays. Man, I love Mondays. It sets the tone for the week. And yesterday was a little slow. So I knew that, t that this week was going to be a little slow. It was going to be a little testy. I knew that the weather was going to get worse. And, you know, like Monday was cool, calm, collect. Weather was good. It was calm for your boy. Today was a little hot. It was hotter than fuck. So, I mean, I knew that today was going to be a bad day right from rip. When you walk out the door in the summertime and your windows are foggy because you know that the pressure's about to change and everything's about to change about the day and it's gonna be hot it sucks sucks so anyway yeah man that was it bro man rules in the shitter know your man rules every other urinal every other stall unless every other urinal and every other stall is taken up that's the only time the only time ever you break the man code man it's your boy, Brian Ash, a.k.a. The Handsome Fister. Thank you for watching another episode of 300 Seconds. And I hope to see you on the next one. And if you like this shit, you thought it was funny, share it, bro. Because let's go. Manco broken. Boom.